I'm going to do an exercise for Hong Kong Mahjong. If you're new to this version, there is a link in the video description below to a lesson playlist. Also, there's a link to this quick reference, which has all the scoring in it and instructions for how to play the game. For this exercise, we're going to practice scoring a hand. I like to call the exercise, score this. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. This was a winning hand at Mahjong time. It was the East round, and this is the East player. They self-picked their pair weight. Pause the video and score this. In a live game, if this were my hand, I would score for a half flush, which is three fawn. There's a mixture of pungs and a chow, so we won't get all pung, because there's a chow there. This north, we don't get scored there because it's east round, east seat. We have a two and a four flower, so no score there. So three fawn for half flesh, one fawn for self pick, and everybody pays double. So this would be four fawn. Four fawn is 16 points, so everybody would pay 32. Let's see how Mahjong time scored it. Four fawn, 32 points each, which equals 96. So this would be 96 received, 32 from each player. When you play online at Mahjong time, the game will score your winning hand for you. In a live setting, you're responsible for scoring your own hand. If you have a set of tiles at home, give this exercise a try and test your skill at scoring. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next score this for Hong Kong Mahjong, may all your picks be keepers.